this game has exactly 60 minutes to impress me. And if not, I will delete this game and move on to the next game of choice, Hogwarts Legacy. Let's get it. I'm telling you, I'm about to get lock in character customization for about 30 minutes. <laughs> All right. Oh uh, boy, look like Will from the new Fresh Prince of Bel-Air. <laughs> It appears we are almost ready to depart. It's a pity we didn't have a bit more time to spend on spell casting. I presume you've been practicing the spells we worked on. I have, Professor. Well, I'm quite he sure. He lying his ass off. Take so quickly to a second-hand wand. You'll be a force to be reckoned with when you get your own. Thank you, Professor Fig. I appreciate you working with me all the time. Where does this motherfucker come from? Oh, <laughs> Eleazar. George, glad my rather cryptic description of our location did not thwart your finding us. I've apparated to more vaguely defined destinations than this. <laughs> Though I confess I may have miscalculated slightly on my first try. <laughs> Gave quite the fright to some theater goers in the West End. <laughs> it's been much too long. When I received your owl, I must uh, say I... Best not speak here, Eleazar. Mm. Of course. Why don't we speak en route to Hogwarts? We have a start of term feast and a sorting ceremony to get to. Wonderful idea. As long as your young charge here doesn't mind me tagging along. Not at all, sir. After you. Ages since I've been to the castle. Would be good to see the old pile of rocks. It's, ain't no horse on there. Oh, that's right. We're dealing with witches and warlocks and wizards and shit. Warner Brother Games. traveling companion a new student new yes sir I'm starting school as a fifth year how extraordinary it is indeed none of the faculty has ever heard of anyone being admitted to Hogwarts so late nor have I of course as the other fifth years will have been honing their magical skills for four years now the headmaster asked if I could get our new student up to speed a bit before the term begins well you couldn't have asked for a better mentor. Professor Fig is not only an exceptional teacher, he's also a remarkably intuitive and gifted wizard. You Mr. better teach Osric me something. prone to flattery. I dare say it's one of the reasons he's risen so far at the ministry. <laughs> have you seen this? Uh, I ain't uh, never seen a newspaper that fucking moved. As to how great a threat Ranrock really is. Although I've yet to convince my colleagues at the Ministry, I the fuck is that? he is a significant threat. And it was your wife, Eleazar, who alerted me to his activities months ago. Miriam? How? <sighs> she wrote to me about Ranrock before she died, wondering what the Ministry knew about his activities. Before I could respond, I received this it was the last thing she sent me Eleazar. what is it that? came to me via her owl but with no correspondence i can only assume that she had to get rid of it quickly to keep it safe presumably from ranrock i cannot open it whatever magic protects this is powerful indeed it looks like goblin metal 
That symbol. What's that glow? I don't see a glow. Nor do I. Hmm. Merlin's beard. How did you wait? We do. Whoa! Shit! Don't tell me we gotta fight this motherfucker. Nah, fuck that. Man, fuck that key. The key. Give me your hand. Oh shit. a bit take this it's Wigan world potion that stuff will write you in a second heal by pressing down okay she look like some hypnotic <laughs> what happened? Oh, George. I can't believe he what the hell got into that damn thing Attacking a carriage mid-air? A typical dragon would never... Professor? <sighs> Sir, where are we? I'm not sure. But that key you discovered was clearly a port key. Port key? An item enchanted to bring whoever touches it to a specific place. I'm feeling better, sir, if you'd like to look around a bit. I would, but stay close. We've no idea who created this port key. For real. Or why. Holy fucking shit. How far did that port key take us? farther from London than the carriage traveled. We're somewhere in the Scottish Highlands. So, those ruins. Do you think the port key was meant to lead us there? This game looks I beautiful. Do. This has not been the day either of us expected. But Miriam sent that port key to George for a reason. And I believe that she, and now George, died in pursuit of whatever it was meant to lead to. If you're sure you're all right and wouldn't mind indulging me, I'd like to have a look around. Absolutely. Yeah, sir. yeah, let's look around this beautiful ass let's world. Let's see if we can find a path, however faded it may be. Boy, this game looks awesome. Mind your step. Where do you suppose your wife got the port key that brought us here? A good question. Miriam spent years searching for evidence of a long forgotten form of ancient magic. Ancient magic? Yes. A powerful magic wielded by a rare few that seems to have been lost to time. Hogwarts Castle was built by and is itself a stronghold of that ancient magic. I don't know where she came into possession of the port key, but I am certain it was to do with that search. Ah, oh, there's the path down below. This way. How are we gonna get down there? But sir, why was your wife searching for evidence of lost magic? Miriam wanted to understand why such powerful magic disappeared from the wizarding world. Spoke of the good it could do. But magic is no different than any power. What really matters is the one who wields it. 
the fuck is this shit? Is that ice? It's not cold enough here. It appears to be a sort of enchantment. Yeah. Someone wanted to block this path. Let's see some of that wand work you were practicing. Focus on the center. All right, I get to use my wand now. Okay. Tap R2 to perform a basic cast. Okay. Use your camera and right stick to select an active target. Okay. Some players prefer to select targets and move the avatar with the same stick by disabling the camera. Okay. That was a bit rougher than I'd expected. It's only, you only say that because you're old. I got young blood in me. Ah, up there. All right, let's go. We're close now. It's just ahead. Give me that. This motherfucker just built the bridge. I'll be damned. Almost there. Why would someone have built this here? I suspect they valued their privacy. That port key led us here for a reason. Let's have a look around for anything that seems out of place. Okay. The mini map shows your surrounding with the thing that is not just a person hold the target. Okay. Well, in our investigate. Professor. It's a mural of some kind. Mm. Perhaps our host was a noted seer. Interesting. Uh. Climb. Breaking shit. You said look for something that's out of place. I had a feeling it was going to be over here. Professor, this statue... This may have been his home. Okay, look, we can go back here. That enchanted crystallized stone again. But what could it be blocking? What's this? Professor Fig! Fuck. someone have conjured that enchanted stone here and how is there a room behind it what room i don't see anything there's that glow again like the glow on the port key container 
So only I can see it. What in Merlin's name? Godric's heart. Where are we? I don't believe it. What the fuck? Hello? Just a moment. <laughs> Boy, you need to trim your nails, though. <laughs> Welcome to Gringotts Wizarding Bank. Vault number 12, I presume. <laughs> Precisely. The key. Your wife's porky. Oh, yes, of course. This way, then. Stay close. <whistles> After you. Nah, you get on first. They put a lot of detail into this game, though. Are private entrances to the bank common at Gringotts? They are most uncommon. Only one with great wealth or power, or both, could have arranged for such a service. You want to take a breath? A what? That waterfall washes away all enchantments. It's a security measure. Experienced the thief's downfall before, have you? Heard of it? These are the lower vaults that we're passing now. How deep well, are this game on? looks Vault number amazing. Vault was commissioned shortly after Gringotts was founded over four centuries ago. It resides in the deepest part of the bank. Settle in. We've quite a distance to go. Number. Vault 12. Momentous day. <laughs> hmm. On your way. wondering about that goblin back there. He watches over the oldest section of the bank. Rare anyone goes there anymore. Hmm. I wonder why. I feel a setup coming. Last time this fort was accessed. A goblin has been stationed at my desk for hundreds of years. In that time, no one has visited Vault 12 until today. Hmm. Vault 
12. Thank you for your help. Oh man, we finna get stuck in this bitch, I know it. What do you suppose we should be looking for? I'm not sure. Sir, I wonder if you might... The instructions for Vault 12 indicate that I am to grant access to the holder of the key and then close the door. Wait. I told you. Best of luck. <sighs> Professor? That was certainly unexpected. Not for me. Let me think. There must be something here. Hmm. Revelio, perhaps. Revelio? Yes, a revealing charm. No time like the present. Let's see what we're missing, shall we? Ready your wand and focus. Okay. Oh, I fucked that up. Okay, we're gonna do this again. Got it. Revelio. There, I saw something. Move a bit closer and try again. Okay. A door. Well, that's a start. Mm -hmm. There's that symbol again. Sure is. I don't suppose you see a way to. I do, Professor. That symbol has the same glow as the one I saw on the port key container. If what you can see reveals the way forward, then I dare say we are about to discover the secret of this vault. Lead the way. All right, let's boogie. Lumos. This is no ordinary vault. I suspect we will need to earn our way out of here. What do you mean, earn our way out? Do you think this is some sort of test? I do. Revelio. But to what end, I can't say. Stay close. There will be no disapparating if things go poorly. Not out of Gringotts. All right, I'm following your ass, bro. I don't know what the fuck Revelio means. Might means reveal. I see something up ahead. What is it? That glow again, but on the floor. Oh shit. What happened? When I moved towards the glow, it suddenly seemed as if the ground was swirling about. Are you all right? Yes, sir. I'm fine. You seem to have caused the floor to change. That statue? What statue? I see some sort of statue, but only as a reflection in the floor. Revelio, I presume this is what you saw reflected in the floor. It is. Yep. The reflection's still there, but the statue's positions don't match. Wait, when you moved, the reflection turned in the direction of the light. Hmm, perhaps you should cast Lumos. Okay, let's cast it, yeah. Okay. Got it. Spell set Lumos creates a light and at the tip of the wand to help you see dark areas. Okay. Lumos, well done. Now the reflection is turning towards me. It does follow the light. Revelio. Lumos. Okay. So what are we looking for? Oh. What the fuck is... Oh, man. 
We're about to have to fight. Told you. Oh shit, old man got some moves. Let me get some of that. Come on. Bitch. What else? Oh shit. Get up! Come on! Got you. Come on. Woo! Oh. Take that! Come on! Come on! Wave that motherfucking wand! Wave that shit! Look at you! Come on! You! 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 You want some of this? Review your objectives to reveal the way forward. Okay. Come on. Defendo. Defendo. Woo. Defendo. Look at you. Nope, nope, nope. You know about that stick talk. Professor, Professor Fig, Professor, where are you? This isn't good. Supposed to go. Oh shit, okay. Lumos. Lumos. What's happening? The wisps of magic seem to be leading me somewhere. Okay, they're taking me this way. I ain't scared of no dark. I got a fucking wand. Ah, that's where they're leading me. Let glow again. Lumos. Rebellio. I suppose I'm on my own this time. Okay. Oh shit, we're about to fight again. I'm about that. I need to align these statues with their reflections. Woo. Come on. Nope. Can't touch this. Woo. No. Take that. You take that too. Hold triangle there in Protego to stun enemies with a super f stupefy counter attack. Okay. Objective, okay. Stupid. 
There we go. Oh shit! Get up! Get up! Get up! Come on! Fuck! There we go. Come on. Another one. Gotcha. Destroy the statue. What a statue. Rebellion. Lumos. Shit. Is this it? Okay. We need to be going over here. Okay, we can sprint. Okay, cool. Professor? Are you over there, Professor? All right, investigate. There you go. How did you? What is this place? I don't know. <clears throat> but I found this floating above that basin. That is no mere basin. That is a pensive for viewing memories. I wonder. doing that all is in place the poor key is well hidden perhaps too well I wonder if the path we've created may be impossible to follow. It will only be impossible for one who cannot see traces of ancient magic as I can. Your ability to see what others cannot will not be enough, Percival. We are entrusting the one who embarks on this path with powerful secrets, with knowledge others will do anything to obtain. Yes, hmm. and if we are correct, Charles, the witch or wizard who completes the trials will have proven themselves worthy of that knowledge and the responsibility that accompanies it. We've done all that we can. That's what you're seeing. The glow that surrounded them. Yes, sir. Astonishing. Can I see magic? Traces of an ancient magic, to be precise. Hmm. The magic that Miriam had always believed existed, but could never. Miriam, and perhaps George, died in pursuit of knowledge that has been dormant for centuries. And you, it seems, are the key to understanding why. We were looks rather different than it did a moment ago. <laughs> Someone's coming. Who were they? Let them come. Know. But, sir, you shouldn't be in there. I was right. Ranrock. 
Seems my reputation precedes me. I was beginning to think no one was ever gonna visit Rackham's vault. And why are you here? No need for that. Just give me whatever it is you found here and we can let bygones be bygones. I ain't giving you shit. <coughs> uh, sir, they have the key to the vault. <laughs> Choose your next words wisely. I... I only meant that the instructions to Vault 12 were quite clear. Sir, I, I must insist. I was to grant access only to one with the key, and you didn't have it. Oh, shit. I have no patience for traitors. Now, where were we? I'm not giving you anything. Now I say you ain't giving them shit. Well, perhaps your young friend here will be more helpful. All right, let's fight then. Motherfucker. Are you all right? Fine, sir. I've never seen so powerful a goblin. He seemed wholly unaffected by my magic. Where are we? It seems those who set up the pensive, the locket, and the path to both wanted someone with your ability to end up here. Hmm. Come. We have a sorting ceremony to get to. We sure do. They put a lot of detail in this game. sorting ceremony I'm no expert but that seems more appropriate now thanks for the new threads I need to study this locket as soon as I can but first I must contact the ministry they need to know what happened to George and be warned of Ranrock for the moment I ask that you keep all that's happened this evening between you and me of course sir thank you ready for the sorting ceremony they get it
Phineas Nigellus Black. Prepare yourself to meet the Headmaster. Fig, nice of you to join us. The sorting ceremony is over. There were complications. Complications? It seems the goblin Enough. problem has... Goblins. I've no time for rumors, Fig, and I'm rapidly losing whatever patience I had left. If you're lucky, we might still be able to get you sorted this evening. <clears throat> I'll be in touch. Professor Weasley, we've one more to be sorted. What type of Welcome. fucking head is You're that? Just in time. Have a seat. Nah, keep that. Nah, bro, keep that shit away from me, bro. Ah, yes, a bit older than the others, aren't you? You come here with preferences and preconceptions. Certain expectations. Yeah. I can't wait to explore, bro. I'm looking forward to exploring Hogwarts and the world beyond the castle and grounds. Hmm. Indeed. Much can be gleaned by having an adventurous spirit, but your professors have a great deal to teach you as well. Mm. I wonder... Mm. I detect something in you. A certain sense of... Mm. What is it? Ambition. Is it ambition? I may seem single-minded, but it is important to go after what you want from life. Facts. Mm, interesting. You've recently learned that you possess a rare ability. I detect a growing sense of ambition. An eagerness for power. Perhaps you belong in Slytherin. The sorting hat will take your choice into account when sorting you into the house. Okay. I'll take it. I'll go to the Slytherin house. You belong in Slytherin! One more thing. Due to the unfortunate injury on the pitch in last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season has been cancelled. Enough! It's not as though I've banned flying altogether. But don't tempt me. You are here to focus on your academic futures. I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. I said, I'm sure you all have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. Quite an entrance. It's lovely to meet you. I'm... Professor Weasley, would you be so kind as to show our new student to their common room? I shall see to it, sir. Let's go. As I was saying, I'm Professor Weasley. Pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you as well, Professor. As Deputy Headmistress, it is my distinct honor to show you to your common room. Right this way. Let's slide then.
It's quite uncommon for a student to begin as a fifth year. It may be a bit of a challenge, but one I'm sure you're up for. I can be quite resourceful. I suspected as much. This is the entrance to the Slytherin common room. In order to enter, one must simply speak the correct password. Aspiration. Mm. Very well. Aspiration. Bet. Well done. Now, go on in and get some sleep. You have a big day ahead of you tomorrow. I shall be back in the morning to collect you for your first class. Thank you, Professor Weasley. You're welcome. I hope you enjoy your first night at Hogwarts. Sleep well. Looks like everyone's gone. Better head to the common room. All right, let's go. I suppose some introductions are in order. I don't want to talk to these people. I want to fight some of these people. Let's go talk to these people then. That is not helpful. Can I help you? Ah, oh, you're the new fifth year. I'm Sebastian Sallow. Welcome to Slytherin. Thank you. Not everyone has a ministry escort to school. He was a friend of Professor Figs who merely joined us for the ride. Still, impressive. Dreadful way to go, poor fellow. Glad you and Fig are all right. It was exciting. It was dreadful, certainly, but quite an experience nonetheless. Interesting perspective. How did you and Fig manage to escape? It's all still a bit of a blur, to be honest. Didn't mean to press. You just get yourself settled. We can talk more later. Nice to meet you. It was nice meeting you, Sebastian. I'll let you get back to your book. Nice meeting you too. Good luck today. Right, so we don't spoke to one of these motherfuckers. I wouldn't do that if I were you. We'll speak to her last. I really hope we get to see or at least hear one today. I I think I heard one. Hmm. Doubt mermaids find us that interesting. Ah, based on all the chatter when you entered the common room, I'm guessing you're the new fifth year. I'm ominous. Ominous gone. Nice to meet you, Ominous. Well, you certainly had a memorable arrival. Well, if I'm going to make my mark here, I had to start right away. <laughs> Facts. You're definitely in the right house. Do let me know if I can be of any help as you navigate your first days here, though I doubt you'll need it. Very nice to meet you. Thank you, Ominous. Very nice to meet you. Pleasure was all mine. Don't be a stranger. Uh, might want to think that again. Ugh, not going to move there, are you? Here, watch this. Don't say I didn't warn you. Checkmate. Told you. You should have listened to me. Ah, oh, I know who you are. You're the new Slytherin, the one who barged in with Professor Fig last night. Interesting tactic on your first day, taking all the attention away from the first years. I'm Amelda, by the way. Shame I wasn't with you and Fig. I could have lured that dragon away. My skills on a broom are legendary. Man, you just talking. Perhaps Professor Fig's friend would have survived if we'd had your help. Precisely. Perhaps one of these days I'll show you a thing or two about flying. I can teach you more than Kagawa ever could. Speaking of which, I'd like to get in some time on my broom before classes.
Farewell then. Goodbye, Amelda. Nice meeting you. Is the new fifth year Slytherin in here? Professor Weasley's waiting for you just by the stairs. All right, let's go. Okay, we gotta go upstairs. Cool. Good morning. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts? I've been dreaming of this day for a long time. Can't believe I'm here. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. Now, in light of your unique situation, joining us as a fifth year, you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. OWLs? Yeah, what the fuck is that? Owls? Owls. Yes, your ordinary wizarding level exams. They will determine what type of career you can have when you leave here. After much discussion with the headmaster and the Department of Magical Education at the Ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. I bet. Here you are. Oh, shit. What is it? It is a wizard's field guide. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's expected of a fifth year. You would be wise to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. I sure will. Thank you, Professor, but what do you mean it will keep track of what I'm learning? Perhaps seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have. Right, Walk with me and we shall put it to the test. Let's do it. This way. I certainly would have appreciated something like the field guide when I was a student. Using the guide will also train you to be alert to your surroundings. The guide will give you opportunities to practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding law. Do keep up. Why don't you cast Revelio on that statue? And see what details the field guide can provide. Okay. Revelio. Okay. This statue depicts the Kelpie, a shape-shifting water demon native to Ireland and Great Britain. Okay. Lock this monster. You just unlock the field guide challenge. You can progress towards completing challenges up here. Okay, open the film. Right. This is a wizard level XP earned from challenges to increase your level and power. Well, timer is officially up. The game starts off extremely fucking slow, but I do like using the little magic little wand stick shit. And for the most part, I do want to play more because I don't know what the game is about. So good shit. I'm going to keep playing more.